give the hat. I'm um, deep conditioning under here, you know, in preparation for washing my hair later today. But anyway, you guys, I went back to Play-Dohs. Um, the clearance that they had that was left over from the grab bag last Saturday is now one dollar. One dollar. Y'all might want to go to your Play-Dohs in your area if you have any and check it out. Every location is different. I believe they carry different things. Well, slightly different things, you know. And um, their clearance is going to be a little different. Like the one in Arlington is 70% off, which to me is not as good as, you know, everything being a dollar. But I'm so thankful and excited that mine down the street was one dollar for every single item. And there was there was so much stuff left. I mean, not so much stuff, but so much good stuff left. And I guess people didn't realize it was the sale is still going on because I got a lot. As you can see, look at all this. And what's in here is the stuff that I could not possibly have fit into this bag, into the grab bag, like men's pants and, you know, other, other denim, like larger size denim that I found. So anyway, let me show you what I got. So first off, I have Seven for All Mankind jeans. I saw these but didn't grab them during the grab bag. It's like a camo color, not color, but it's like a... I don't know. It's like camel. Let me see. Hopefully you can see that. Anyway, it's cropped skinny. I think it's their cropped skinny um, jeans. So yeah, those are really nice. They were $8. And also Lucky Brand. These are so nice and they're such, in such great, like excellent condition. Boot cut really nice lucky brand which is one of my favorite brands and they're they're they've got stretch to them so um i see a lot of lucky brand for some reason that don't have a whole lot of stretch they're very good quality but they don't have a lot of stretches which is stretch to them which is what i like in um in jeans so anyway boot cut one dollar lucky brand oh, i'm so excited about this stuff y'all banana republic banana republic Skinny jeans. Skinny jeans are very nice. Practically brand new, if not brand new. Let's see. Paper denim and cloth, which I had actually never heard of before now, but there I looked them up and they're pretty good. They're pretty good jeans. So yeah, paper denim and cloth. Light boot cut. One dollar. Ooh, my first pair of, I think my second pair of, um, I think it is my first pair of Sim for All Mankind corduroy pants. Plain black, which is nice. I wear them with a lot of stuff. So very happy to find these. Boot cut cords. Seven for all mankind. One dollar. Oh, and these are a larger size that I did not get in during the grab bag because they're they're bigger and they wouldn't have fit. This size 11. I'm going to sell them or give them away. They're brand new. Oh my goodness. They're brand new. They're gorgeous jeans. They're like a really dark, deep wash. They're so nice. I like this little lightning detail right here. Well, it looks like lightning anyway. So size 11. They're straight leg. They're really nice. I'm sure I know somebody who wears a size 11. If not, I'll just sell them. And I think the same person or the same store donated these because here's another size 11. Brand spanking new. Citizens, citizens of Humanity. Black boot cut. Is that boot cut? Yeah, I think it's boot cut brand new they're so so nice i don't know how people pass these up because i i got there like days after the clearance the one dollar clearance started they were still there pure men's um jeans some for my husband william rast really nice very good condition like new condition pretty much I don't, well, I always say in my videos, sorry, I keep repeating it, but I typically um, only buy, like, really good condition um, clothing. 
and shoes and purses. I leave every, uh, if it's not in good condition, I'll just leave it at the store. Anyway, this is uh, Decibel. Nice gray color. Very, like, heavy, durable jean material. So these are nice. And my husband needed some more denim pants, so I was very happy to find those. One dollar. DKNY. Look at the pockets on these. Aren't this, isn't this so nice? I love that detail there. And my husband likes to keep it simple, typically, and then I, um, I thought, well, you know, I'll just buy these after, you know, since they're a dollar, let me just buy them. If he doesn't like them, I'll sell them. But he actually liked the pockets, you know? And the William Rass pants, he didn't mind that they were kind of distressed a little bit. <laughs> anyway, DKNY, I'm telling you, he really likes to keep it simple. So, anyway, he liked them, especially for a dollar. You can't beat that. And then I found two pairs, uh-oh. Two pairs of pants, both brand, I mean shorts, both brand new, both too small, so I'll be selling them. Antonio Milani, very cute, like a sat satin, sateen material. Um, they're like a tan color, brand new. Very nice pants, um, shorts, wow, I keep calling them pants. Very nice, very, very nice. And then La Cité. I'm not sure if that's the way to pronounce it, but they're also brand new. Normally $75. I don't know much about that brand at all. So cute. Sequin. More sequin. They're too short for me, so I wouldn't wear them anyway. Even if I could fit them, but they're an extra small, so I can't fit them. So I will be selling these things. $1. So that's that. So that was a clearance sale. And then I got a purse. I mean a handbag. Um, Dooney and Burke. Plato's Closet. Same time I, I bought the clearance. I saw this hanging up and thought, did that? That looks like very good condition. And did that price tag say $25 for brand new Dooney and Burke? Because it looks brand new. And I opened it up. Brand new. $25. I don't know what the heck they were doing. <laughs> pricing it that low but it's, it's so nice and um it's perfect this this um it's, it's in perfect condition this comes off it's really really cute i love it so much it's a nice size it has a slip pocket inside it has this i think all of them all authentic dunia brick have that it has a zippered zippered um area it's just it's so so nice it has a beautiful red lining it's so gorgeous and the leather is very very durable and like kind of kind of hard which i like and this you can undo this i'm not sure i ever will but anyway here's the here's the um Dunienberg name label it's so cute i think it's so cute isn't this such a cute purse i mean handbag i keep saying um, purse, I mean handbag, because I just looked up, I don't know if you all know this, but um, I looked up the difference recently, the difference between a purse and a handbag, and it said um, a purse is typically a hundred bucks and less. If something is a um, hundred bucks and more, it's a handbag. I don't know if that's true or not, but that's what I saw um, in that article. So anyway, very cute. Isn't this gorgeous? So anyway, yeah, go ahead and check out your Plato's Closet and see if they have any clearance because um, it's probably being moved out. They're just, they're dropping prices on everything, all of their clearance items so they can move it on out. And I believe I asked and they said they do it twice a year. So yeah, be prepared for the clearance to go psycho again um, in um, probably December or something, you know. But anyway, that's my haul. Thanks for watching. And again, check out your Plato's. Thanks for watching. Bye.